Do you want to go live on Twitch directly from your phone without expensive softwares, annoying setup, and a bunch of steps? Well, today I'm going to show you the easiest way to stream on Twitch from your phone completely for free, both in IRL and vlogging format, as well as if you want to stream mobile games. Do you want to turn your long streams into viral shorts without having to spend hours editing? That is where Nexus Clips comes in. All of the biggest streamers are posting clips daily because that's just how new viewers discover people these days. TikTok, YouTube Shorts, Instagram Reels. This is where people are finding streamers these days because it's so hard to just be organically found on Twitch. If you aren't posting clips already then i'm sorry but it's normal that people aren't discovering you and getting you the growth that you really want with nexus clips you can automatically create multiple viral ready clips from every single stream they have a built-in ai that finds you the best moments crops your horizontal streams or even videos into vertical perfectly using facial recognition and it adds animated subtitles a hook a sticker everything you need to keep somebody watching you can even customize all of this to match your channel's colors and vibes every single stream will give you a massive list of clips and it'll even rank them by how viral they're likely to go that way you know exactly exactly which clips are going to perform best. So no more spending hours watching back and clipping your streams. Nexus Clips handles all of this for you so you can just focus on streaming, engaging with your chat and reaching new audiences every single day. So seriously, click that link down below to try it for free or use code CAL for 10% off of any order on that website and watch your content skyrocket and your growth on Twitch boom. Back to the video. So let's get you live in a couple of minutes, shall we? And you should totally like and subscribe because this is going to be a very quick and amazing tutorial. Uh, so first, download the Twitch app from the App Store or Google Play. It doesn't matter which device you have, this will work on both because this is of course the platform you're streaming to and the app actually allows you to do this now very seamlessly which is what we're going to be using today once it's downloaded make sure you're logged into your twitch account and now let's set up your irl stream first and then i'll move on to gaming as well so open the twitch app tap your profile picture in the top left and then tap go live you can add a stream title choose your category enable camera and microphone access which is important by the way because otherwise how is it going to see or hear you you silly numpty then you can hit start stream and you're live that is quite literally as simple as it gets depending on the device and software you have on your phone you should be able to use your front or back camera for selfie mode or to show your surroundings super simple for vlogging travel streams or just chatting with your audience from your home wherever you are like here hello quick tip though make sure your internet connection is stable whether that's wi-fi or data on the go because that is a big thing it will keep dipping trust me if you don't have a good enough connection so get that sorted before anything else and remember wi-fi will always be better for longer streams so if you're going to be doing it on the go make sure it's super 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 certain that you're going to have good speeds now for mobile gaming you'll need twitch's mobile streaming tool so open the app again tap on your profile and then tap go live again like you did last time but this time you can select screen capture sometimes it's called something different it might just say gaming or mobile games something like that but that will be the option for you you then might have to give your phone permission to record your screen and your microphone obviously give the permission because again how is it going to see your game otherwise and then you can launch your mobile game twitch will capture it live for you and again you can add a title hit start stream and boom you are streaming games from your phone without any pc any extra software or any more gear or setup now if you're doing the irl option and doing like vlogging irl content this is super easy you shouldn't have too many issues some mobile games will be more tricky than others some of it might not show on stream because you have to go into your game settings specifically and allow recording streaming in the settings so it actually pulls through to a different software and some games might not let you stream them all together unfortunately whilst mobile gaming is getting a lot better recently it's also still probably at the very very ass end of gaming in general and some games or even phones might work better by getting the stream labs app which is equally free and has a bit more customization if you want alerts pop-ups overlays like your follower pop-ups bits stuff like that and whilst it's equally free free and beginner friendly like the Twitch app is because obviously how easy was this right it took a couple of minutes it still can be a bit more complicated so if you'd like a full guide on Streamlabs and how to do that from phone with alerts overlays and all of that fun stuff then let me know down below in the comments because I'd be happy to share that with you too and make a video dedicated just to that now to close out here's a few more extra quick tips just in general for either IRL or gaming streams to make it go as smoothly as possible first of all use headphones to avoid audio feedback obviously you're going to be talking into the mic and any audio will be coming out of the speakers on your phone both of those are pretty close to each other so you don't want that feedback loop of the game audio going back through the mic and causing a delay or echo so please 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 whether it's airpods or even just wired cheap ones get some headphones before you do that especially if you're going to be doing the gaming irl not so much doesn't really matter but with gaming make sure you have the headphones another tip is keep your phone on do not disturb during this time because trust me you don't want private text popping up on stream if you're going to be doing irl from home or gaming with a camera on your face like a webcam then make sure your lighting's good because it can be really annoying and grainy especially coming through a phone camera especially if you don't have the best signal and lastly interact with your chat just like you would if you were streaming at a desktop it might feel different doing a stream this way but ultimately you're still streaming and it's still important to try and be entertaining and have a good time and that is it that should be everything you need to get going with the fundamental basics of streaming on twitch directly from your phone using the app itself but like i said leave a comment if you want more details on Streamlabs or other options too if you want some free twitch artwork before you go my website will be down below with a ton of free packs as well as a very cheap everything pack to get you everything you need to start going live on twitch whilst you're down there you'll also find our community discord which has 300 plus other streamers and creators just like you so if you want to make some friends 
friends or even just get some advice, then feel free to jump in. We would love to have you in. And in the meantime, here's your last chance to subscribe before you go. And here's another video that you might find helpful on your streaming or creator journey. Hopefully I'll see you in the next video. Mwah.